Hello my precious everyone! Welcome back to Wow Mal. You may notice that the happy face plates from my slime video have made a return and that's because it is arts and crafts time! I mean, did the slime video count as arts and crafts? I didn't make it. Whatever, we are vibing. So it's becoming summertime and then my brain was thinking it said no. What is summer to you? Then my brain answered. It said pool and nightmares and grass. I didn't want to take you inside my pool or reenact my nightmares. So here we are with crafts. We have like a ton of crafts and I basically was just like, mom, what do you got? And she was like, okay, and whipped out this rock painting kit, which I mean, technically I probably could have just found rocks and then just painted them. But we're doing this. Also, I know some of y'all are probably already out there stressing because I'm gonna be painting white with like a fairly nice cardigan coat thing and I would just like to say I'm just gonna try not to mess this up I didn't even read any fun tips and tricks Chinese symbols maybe I won't go the cultural appropriation route organic design sky these are cute it's pride month I'm doing how many are there one two three four five six seven eight that is a lot of friends. I think this would be good for the rainbow. So maybe I'll do that first. This one, I just looked at it and my brain was like, his name is Big Daddy George. So this is Big Daddy George. Oh, but I'm gonna just get started. Oh my gosh, it comes with cheapo, I almost called them pretzels. Cheapo brushes, we're gonna use them. Oh my gosh. And it comes with eyes so I can make them my friends. Hello. Please let me in. I'm scared of this like squirting. This is dry. Oh, oh, this wasn't supposed to be finger painting, but it is now. I just shoved my hand in the white. Oh my gosh. And I kept this wrap on. I'm a mess. I'm flopping, boys. It told me to coat this in white to fry it, but I also feel like it didn't come with nearly enough white paint to prime all of them. Also, I feel like I should have it be noted um, I'm not really much of a painter. I was never that good at art. Like, I did it because I liked it. Not because I had any talent or even any skill. I just kind of flopped at art. But I don't think you necessarily have to be good at something to enjoy it. Sometimes things can just be a hobby and you can suck at it and that's chill. We're letting him dry. You know I'm getting more paints. This is not enough paints. I need more color in my life. Big Daddy George, let's get it. I'm scared. It's a little boopy, but probably old. Brown and white is how you make tan. Actually, why does this low-key look pink? That's okay to make it a little more tan. Just add a spot of yellow. That was a lot of yellow. Ew. I, what did I do? You will get going on Big Daddy George. You know, maybe I should have primed him too. I was like, meh, priming, who needs it? Me, me needs it. Oh, you know what? I should make like a family. We should have little Susie who lives next door. We will have baby George. Big Daddy George will have a husband named Thoughtful Lou. Oh. No, little George! Oh, this is stressful. Come on, Susie. Also, if for some reason you hear very faint talking in the background, my mom and little sister are in the basement cleaning things up, but they talk really loud. So you might still hear them. Thoughtful Lou is right here. He got some ridges. Oh, am I supposed to like prime the whole thing? I've only been priming like the top and the sides. Is that fine? Should I just prime all the other ones? I feel like I'm gonna regret not priming them. 
Okay, we are primed and ready to go. I feel like this is like a makeup tutorial. Primer is on, and now we'll go with foundation. They did light blue after this. Do I trust that? Is that primed enough? Hopefully. All right. Let's vibe. Ew, this feels horrible. Actually, let's not vibe. Ooh, this is a pretty color. I think I could do two layers of this and be totally fine. This color is giving me leaves. Let me go look at some more. Paw print. I have to do paw print. Guys, you know what I have to do? This alligator is beautiful and hilarious, but honestly, I think it would be funnier if I recreated this giraffe. Cause you see how intricate that is? You really think I am capable of such a feat? This will be Big Daddy George. This will be Thoughtful Lou. That will be the giraffe. This will be Paw Prince. And that will be something I have yet to determine. Seems about right. <laughs> That needs way more white than I thought I did. You know, I should have put the white first and then added a little bit of red. I'm just going with little Susie. I'm a little impatient. How are you? Still a little wet. Well, too bad. So my sister had the big brain idea of putting the ones I'm not painting outside because it is toasty so they can dry and I was like genius. This one is um little George. He's like almost dry. Also I don't know if I ever addressed this. These are not fake glasses. These are real glasses. I normally don't like wearing my glasses on camera because I just prefer how I look without them. But honestly, kind of completes the look. All right, here we go. Swapping out the rocks. Putting the rocks on the ground was a bad idea because I ended up, um, they smushed together because these plates aren't strong. And now all the colors mixed. Do you see this? I ruined everything I touched. That's how it be. Big George, Thoughtful Lou. Thoughtful Lou, what color do I want to make? Maybe I should make him like a light green. I'm gonna just cover that one up. Aha! Uh -huh! Wait, it's working so good. <coughs> Nana! <coughs> it's quiet time. I'm touching a lot of paint. Everyone who's ever done art is watching this and is like, please stop. I will not stop because no amount of artsy pretentiousness is gonna stop me from having a good time with my rock friends. Good enough. Red. Oh, that's a lot of red. Oh, that is a lot of red. Red. Where be the orange? That, that, that kind of flops, but I'm not here to be picky boys. Once I finish painting the rainbow, I'll just add the clouds and then we'll be beautiful and it will be done. And oh, actually while I do that, I should paint this big one, but I wanted him to be a light purple. You know what, screw it, we gonna make him blue. Well, that's rock hard. I ain't got time for this. It is done, I will show you later. Let's just add some white dots so it looks purposeful. George gets these two big eyes and he gets a mustache. This is really good. As for Thoughtful Lou, I think I'm gonna give him a little like kind of vibe, but I am gonna give Thoughtful Lou hair. This is a mostly clean brush. looks like a lighter green. Little George, let me make your face. Daddy George has two big eyes. Thoughtful Lou, I think, will have two small eyes. 
Baby George is gonna have one big eye and one small eye. Time to make paw prints and then the giraffe. Oh, like it's not that good, but for me, not mad. The pad of the paw, I think I made them a bit too circular, but. Heck, what are you supposed to do? I will be following this. I will just be using an orange, which I really don't have. Oh, the orange we have sucks. I will use yellow. Would you guys unsubscribe if you saw me make a really bad giraffe, or would you be a little more forgiving? Oh, basically I just have to make little Susie's face. Her mouth. Ooh, ooh, face. Let me give you guys the up close visuals of my little rock friends. Here's the disaster zone. Oh yeah, it's fine. Yes, this is Big Daddy George and his husband. Buffalo! What happened to your eyes, my friend? Buffalo has seen better days. Um, I guess that's what I get for not holding his eyes on after I glued them. This is a little Susie. That's her bow. That's her eyes. That's her mouth. I don't know why it went down like this. There's a little black. That's actually the original rock peeking through because I painted over things when they were still wet. And here's little George who by far looks the best. I don't know how he turned out this good. He's got his little blush. A loving family. Let's start with this monstrosity because there's not much to say about it. Um, the purple wasn't covering. That's the bottom. I did not even do the bottom. Um, the purple wasn't covering and I got frustrated and so I just dotted it with white and said, Screw you, I don't care about you. This one, it turned out a little better. The paw prints were getting kind of cute, but then that one got huge. Then I freaked out and kind of made that one huge and now it's like mediocre. So this is the original draft and now let me show you mine. Ta-da! Can't you see the resemblance? Mine looks like a weird hyena giraffe hybrid. But believe me, it was worse without those googly eyes on. It was worse. So basically, in conclusion, I tried. As for this one, this is the only one that turned out somewhat good. The orange kind of flopped a little bit. And, um, okay, don't look at it too hard, but like, from far away, it looks nice. And I really love this shiny blue. Um, we love that. So yeah, those are my rocks. Aww. In conclusion, I love rocks. Thank you for joining me. Go outside, get some fresh air. I will hopefully be doing that once I wrap up this video. Have a beautiful day, my precious everyone. I love you guys so much. I will catch you in the next video.